Adolph Robert Thornton Jr., also known as Young Dolph was born July 27, 1985 in Chicago, Illinois. At the age of two, his family moved to Memphis, Tennessee. He had two sisters and two brothers and also mentioned the late rapper Juice World being his cousin and key Glock. Thornton was mostly raised by his grandmother, Ida May. His parents experienced addictions to crack cocaine which made it harder for him to see them. In fact, he would only see them every few weeks. His grandmother would unfortunately pass away battling lung cancer in 2008. With his grandmother passing and a little bit of encouragement from his friends, Young Dolph decided to pursue a music career. Later on that year, Young Dolph released his first mixtape titled Paper Route Campaign. In 2010, two years after the passing of his grandmother, he established his label Paper Route Empire where he released his first mainstream mixtape titled Welcome to Dolph World. Dolph began to reach success and was catching eyes and ears of many producers and record labels. One of them included Young Yogati. Yogati admired Dolph and his hustle so much, he wanted to sign Dolph to his record label CMG. Dolph respectfully declined, which then started friction between both camps. Both sides began to dissing each other as young Dolph claimed to have slept with Yogati's baby mother. In February 2017, Dolph would become a target after his bulletproof car was shot at over 100 times during a CIA event hosted in Charlotte, North Carolina. Rapper Black Youngsa appeared to be connected to the shooting but charges were later dropped. In September 2017, Dolph was a victim of another incident as he was shot outside a retail store in Hollywood, Los Angeles, California. He was listed in critical condition at the hospital but within a few hours doctors reported he was expected to survive. He spent two weeks in the hospital recovering from three gunshot wounds. Yogati was initially named a person of interest after the shooting but was later cleared. Yogati's friend, Corey McClendon, was arrested for attempted murder and released the next day with no charges. On November 17, 2021, Young Dolph would meet his demise as he was fatally shot in Memphis whilst visiting Makita's homemade butter cookies, a bakery he frequented visited whenever he was back home. Two gunmen in a white two-door Mercedes-Benz gunned him down. An autopsy revealed that Thornton had 22 gunshot wounds from bullet entries and exits. Some wounds were sustained in the forehead and back. Three suspects were eventually charged with the murder of Young Dolph. Trials are set to begin sometime in February. The city of Memphis approved street renaming for a street in the honor of Thornton. The street was changed to Adolph Young Dolph Thornton Jr. Avenue, which is located on the intersection of Dunn Avenue and Dareways Boulevard, not too far from where he was raised and killed. He leaves behind two children and his partner Mianjie. Gone but never forgotten.